Hi, I am Andre. This is my awesome wife Julia. And these are our lovely furry kids Layla, who is always up for fun, and Juno, our master cuddler. As a wonderful and weird family of full-time travelers who love to embrace the escape out of the norm, we invite you to come along on our travels too and explorations of amazing and beautiful locations. We hope you have fun watching! By the way, this is our campsite. My wifey. Knut cool. Knut Knut cool. It's a very cute campsite. Our escape just fits on here. A little bit of space in the back. Not too busy here whatsoever. There's a minivan there. No, I'm a bit in the van. The big problem there. Huh? Can we go down to town? Yeah, let's go cook coffee. Coffee. Britannia mine, uh, this is Squamish, and this is how four miners went to the toilet. And there's my wifey. Ready? Yep, ready. Go. Do you know how many panes of glass there are up there? 14,460. I'm just glad this is the only one I have to keep clean. <laughs> That was great. Very cool. That was very cool, yeah. Really enjoyed that one. Well worth the money. Do you know? Where is she? There she is. Crazy girl. Great view. So that's how a sound, right? A how sound? Yeah. Oh. Well, I guess we earned our dinner. 
We didn't stay long in the Squamish area and are now on our way to a beautiful vineyard in Causton, BC. Hello my fellow Earthlings! Uh, we just woke up and enjoy our morning coffee and this beautiful location that we arrived in yesterday at yesterday. Um, it's our second house host location. I'm always amazed in how much scenery in Canada can, Canada can change in just three hours of drive or even less sometimes. I mean, look at this. And we've been yesterday to, a, um, to, to the restaurant here of the Harvest House and uh, it was delicious. I, of course, as a German, sometimes like my schnitzel <laughs> and that was uh, very good. Uh, it's actually German owners. Uh, I have to check again the, 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 the accurate name here so I don't give you a weird name and you look it up and like, oh, it's not there. Uh, yeah, so it's a beautiful scenery, great location. Uh, yesterday was quite a stressful travel day. It's just the morning started a little crazy. I will elaborate on that it's in some other video. It's just uh, our batteries were dead and as an electrician I'm like, what the heck is going on? And yeah, I figured out what was going on and uh, yeah. Not proud of that one. Yeah, so this is the crow's nest uh, vineyard, vineyards, crow's nest vineyards. Uh, they have a restaurant, a bakery, a shop, and it's windy again, so I'm not sure you hear me. Uh, they have a guest house as well, so it's a great location. We stay, stay with our trailer just there that's the spot for the harvest host guests and it was really nice and quiet loved it lots of sunlight exposure for solar panels and food was delicious very awesome great hosts today we will be moving forward to a different rec site we will see where it will be we have two uh, on, on the road and uh, uh, getting closer to the uh, ferment area, but it will, it will not be a ferment, that might be just the day after uh, from here. Yeah, so here it's oh, a specific spot, no problem having a trailer here. And let's see where my wife is. Hello. Morning. Hey girls. No. Uh -uh. Juno, come on. Inside. Come on. Inside. Come. On. Inside. come. come. It's a bit, little bit windy, but no. oh. very nice. Uh, yeah. Hey, Lila. Must be a huge nose on the TV screen when you watch this video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Yeah. So, after a few hours of driving, uh, we finally arrived at our next destination uh, at Johnson Lake Recreation Site. Um, all free and not just free of payment but hey Lila <laughs> but but we're the only ones well for now so girls can be off leash they enjoy that for sure <laughs> not always on leash campgrounds as always they love running so uh yeah so this uh, Johnson Lake recreation site is close to Skookum Chuck uh, I did have a, I was wondering where that, where that is. I did have a Skookum Chuck burger once at Mr. Mike's here, uh, in, in Alberta actually. It was delicious. Oh well. Um, yeah, so nice lake, nice view, reception. So we have internet and everything. Uh, good for work. Yeah, looks great. I think we will enjoy this. And it will probably be nice and dark tonight, maybe. It clears up a little bit, maybe see some stars. I love looking at stars. 
yeah, I, I don't know. I could look at stars for hours. I'm really bad at remembering which is which one is which. I know the main ones, but, but yeah, and they are the girls. for the Johnson Lake recreation site. User maintained, seems very clean. Uh, of course the usual little pieces in the ground, but oh well, can pick them up bit by bit. That's down there where the trailer is. And here it goes up uh, this way to the uh, highway. And it's not very far from the highway actually. It's just, I don't know, what is that? Um, Maybe 800 meters. I'm not 100% sure if I got that right now, but it's not bad at all. And then you have this fork here, uh, right to the uh, five uh, wreck sites. And then I'm not sure where it goes left, but I will find out. Yeah, so it turns out the uh, um, little road, gravel road to the left, uh, leads kind of to the lake again, or I guess around the lake. Um, that's just literally 200 meters from our spot and uh, some people for sure uh, put some little spots here and uh, extended that wreck site area in, in, in a way um, not sure if they're legit or not but as long as you don't bother anybody and you're not on somebody's property uh, I guess be peaceful and nice forgot your wallet as that's usual. that's unusual. You never forget your wallet, ever. Like ever. Like ever. It sounds like pepper. <laughs> To Banff. To Banff. Yes. Uh, let's see how we get out of here. Gotta do the blocks first. Okay. Now we're gonna get out of here. Sadly. I mean look at it. So pretty. Alright, we are going to go up this little path. It's a bit rocky. Big dip here.
was easier than I thought. But then, I'm not the one who's driving. Bye bye, pretty lake. It doesn't look as gnarly from here in the camera. Do you need me out? It is good. left you should be fine it's just bumpy here got a lift kit on the trailer so we can go to places like this. Mm -hmm. 90, I think I was saying 